penalty means that the target really for these men, if they want to get more than five through, is to go through the first kilometre in somewhere in the region of about 250. Floriani there of Italy just tucking in behind and also there Arascaia wearing the vest of Turkey, the former Kenyan lying in third. Also there wearing five is the tall Dane, Abrahamson, the red vest. But the very fact that they're running, what, two or three wide in the middle of that field does rather suggest that at the moment the tempo is fairly modest. But it is Caro, the Spaniard, out there in, uh, in the lead. There's also a second Frenchman here, a man who will be very familiar to Eurosport audiences, Johan Caval, who is actually the defending champion, one from the back at the moment. You can see him there, the all-blue vest of France, but it's Caro of Spain who has the lead. Abramson there in second place. Kaya of Turkey in third, but at the moment, Stuart, something like 10 metres between front and back. Yeah, and uh, this looked a bit steady to me early on in that race, and uh, they may well suffer. Remember, with the fastest losers, um, if you don't get into the first five, then it's got to be pretty useful as a, a pace. But at the moment, they're just uh, looking very, very steady indeed. This doesn't look as quick as the uh, first of the races that we saw. And I think is a little bit of uh, a push by the Italian there. That's uh, Jamel Chatby, who's an 8-8 man at his very best, 8-21 this season. But he was not content with the uh, slower pace, and he's really pushing it on now. And that's pretty sensible, and it will go, fall into the hands of those who need to qualify as fastest losers, that's for sure. That's well, Kaya of Turkey in second place, tall figure on the left. Well, 2.55 through the first kilometre, that's pretty modest. If you simply do the sums, that takes you through in about 8.45, which is a tempo roughly 15 seconds slower than that of the first race. So it's Chappie out in front. Something of a controversial figure. 8.08, 8, as Stuart was saying, is his fastest time. But since running that, he's served a three-year doping ban. Former Moroccan now wearing the blue, as you can see, of Italy. But he's grasped the nettle here. He has realised that there's need for a bit of tempo. He's taking it on from Kaya, another transferee there of Turkey in second place. Caro of Spain is there in third. You can see the Belgian working his way through as well. That is Jeroen de Hoot. He's an 8.30 man. We've got the split screen. You can see the uh, athletes in the qualifying competition for the pole vault. The bar them at the moment at 5 metres 35. So if you're looking here and watching Eurosport and you've got one or two athletes you're interested in, Robert Renner, you can see on the left there, is involved in that, just taking his first attempt at 5.35. And uh, he pops over, so good news there for him. Meanwhile, on the right-hand side of the screen, you can see Jamel Chatby taking things along in this steeplechase competition. It's Kaya there of Turkey in second place, and they're starting to get strung out here. 2.55 they were through the first kilometre. This second kilometre, I reckon, is going to be, what, 10 seconds or slow faster. So just a chance that we might get athletes from this heat through as fast losers. And Kaya there at that water barrier, no foot on top of the barrier, just going straight over the top of it. So Kai has taken himself into the lead. It's Chappie there in second place. De Hoot there of Belgium now in third place. Johan Koal of France, the defending champion, is taking much closer order. He's now in seventh place. Coming through in third, there is Floriani of Italy. But it's Kaya, the Turk, who leads. The clock ticking on beyond five minutes. Fairly soon we'll be able to keep an eye on the tempo of the race by taking note of the tempo of this second kilometre which I think we can work on the basis with a good deal faster the uh, second heat well you'd look at uh, something like 540 for them this might be a bit slower than that but three men starting to get away and it's Kaya of Turkey Chappi there of Italy in second place and Floriani the second of the Italians is now in third and they're really strung out yeah they are it is much quicker this uh, second thousand metres and 
uh, it's clearly going to give them a chance of fastest losers, although those off the front of those first five are really not in contact now. We've got three, four, five, there's six, seven, and eight, and the sixth is Caval, the defending champion, so he's got a lot of work to do. He's coming through quite nicely now. Uh, to take uh, fourth place with just two laps to go and all of it, all the work being done by Kaya at the moment and that's pretty helpful indeed with Chapby following him along and so is Flodiani, the Italian. Well, the clock froze at 5.44 for two kilometres, but bear in mind that froze on the leading three athletes. So the men who are looking here at perhaps going through as fast losers would have gone through two kilometres a good deal slower than that. But I reckon at the front of the race, we're looking at a very similar time to the first heat. So it's going to be interesting, but it's Kaya out in front just a little more than 600 meters to go in second place is chatby it's then floriani so italy two italy three defending champion of france Joan goal is there in fourth place in fifth is caro of spain who took out the early pace they are the leading five that's the penultimate water jump into the home straight it is kaya in the lead, Chappy on the right. Kaya just moving a little bit towards the outside of the second lane there, just to ensure that the barrier was met perfectly for his stride. Italians on both his left and right shoulders. Koal is there in fourth place. It's Caro now in fifth. And back there in sixth place at the moment is Kavistic, the Estonian who's beginning to lose ground. So the leading five starting to get away. The Belgian De Hoot now back in seventh place. They are contenders to be fast losers. But keep your eye on the clock here. I reckon it's a very similar time to the winning time of the first heat. And we may well get a French winner as well because the defending champion, Koal, has run a pretty quiet race, but he's now got himself right into contention. It is Turkey 1, France 2, Italy 3, Italy 4, Spain 5, and Kavistik there of Estonia making a real race of this. We've got six men, and there are only five chairs out. Who will be able to leap on them when the music stops? The first one is certainly going to be Kaya, the Turk. Final barrier, he's got the lead. Floriani there in second place. Caval now in third, because they've got to be careful here. It's Floriani who's actually getting run out of it. He's going to be the sixth athlete. The winning time, 8.33.13. So very, slim to, very similar to that first race. But I reckon that the sixth man across the line, Floriani, will have done enough to go through as a fast loser. Yeah, I think the rest may well be in a little bit of bother. Uh, but uh, certainly that was in every sense a race of two halves the second uh, part of the second half of the race much quicker than the the first slightly faster but uh, those trailing in were a good deal further back on this second heat than they were in the first but Caval the defending champion took it very very easily didn't look in it at all early on but then made his way slowly but surely and we've got two very very good French athletes there's a faller for you Those barriers, the water jumps and the barriers, 26 and 7. And Kaya really established the tenor of the race. There's no question about that. Those tired legs coming over there. So I'm not sure why one would celebrate a heat uh, in this way, but uh, nevertheless, Mr. Kaya has done just that. So it's a decent crowd on this first night of competition. One or two gaps around the, uh, the stadium here. Hasn't its day held some big crowds before it was uh, an entirely seater stadium. Araskaya, 8.33.11. So Kaya, Chapi, Kowal, Karo, Kavistic go through, as does Floriani.